My name is Jeffrey and I'm a professional illusionist and magician right here in Singapore. I got interested in magic when I was just 7 years old. I saw this TV program and you know this magician he actually uh, float in the air and um, you know his name is Chris Angel. He float in the air and all the audience around him they were amazed, they were shocked you know, and I myself even though um, I'm watching through a screen, I myself was actually amazed you know at, um, at the illusion you know, of him floating and yeah from then on I told myself yes I want to become a magician and bring joy to people. And you know, I find that you know doing magic is really cool, and that's why you know I chose this path. And so basically, these are all my props, and yeah, this is my illusion where I actually saw somebody in the path. So, so actually, you know, I push me in, okay, I push this in, this in, and I push it into the path, and this really freaks people out. It's a big illusion, and I use it for my corporate shows, wedding shows, or any big events, and um. This is um, a prop, a kid's prop. Okay, so you can see there are lights, you know, coming on. Okay, I can even trigger a buzzer. So what this prop, what it does is, I will put a boy shoe inside this, inside this machine, and you know, I will tell the boy this machine will clean your shoe. And what will happen is, um, there's smoke starts coming out, you know, and there's buzzer, you know, and when I open the machine, there's a lot of smoke, and. When I take it out, it's actually a burn shoe and everybody will go crazy. Right? And um, this is um, a meter, you know, where I, I actually use this for my kids' shows. So um, this is more like a gag. So when I ask the kids to cheer, um, it will actually go up. The number will actually go up. Yeah, so it's quite cool. I use this for my kids' shows. And this is actually a collector's item. You know, the last time they produced this was in 1980s. It's quite rare. Um, there's only a few magicians who have this in Singapore and most of them are the senior magicians and basically this is a comedy prop so I'll ask the audience member to shoot at the cards and I tell the audience member one card will fly up but when audience member shoot at the card, you know, the flower starts flying up and I ask them to shoot uh, shoot again one more time and you know, the tablecloth starts to fly up and you know the table will break and yeah, this is one of my um, comedy props this is a prop, you know, where I actually um, light the pan up on fire and you know when I close it, you know, a rabbit will appear. I use this for my kids' shows. And this prop is um, something very unique. They only produce 2,000 pieces of it. And it's actually a smoke machine. It's not really a smoke machine, it's a watch that produces smoke. So um, what I'll do is I'll make something disappear and you know, smoke will come out and this really freak people out. The watch looks really cool. Take a look at it. I'm one of Singapore's youngest illusionists. And you know, um, my dream is to actually tour Asia, you know, do a theatre show and bring joy to as many people as I can. What magic I love doing is close up magic, where I actually show magic right under the audience noses. And you know, that type of magic really freaks people out and most people enjoy close up magic because it's right in front of them. Okay, so now I'm going to teach you a magic trick, but before I teach you a magic trick, I'm going to show you the magic trick, okay? So uh, you can see there's nothing in his hand, and there's nothing in his head. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start by taking this ring, so I'm going to put it into my face just like that, okay? All I need to do is give a magic pass, and a yellow symbol up here. It's like changing colors, alright? Do it a little bit at a time, okay? I don't want to do it too fast. Just a little bit, push it in all the way, just like that. And I can see that I have changed a red seal into a yellow seal. Alright? And you can see there's absolutely nothing in this hand. Okay, there's nothing over here, and there's nothing over here. Okay, now I'm gonna teach you how this trick is done. So, I actually have two seals. Okay? The other seal is right here. Okay? So, what you do is you start by taking this red seal and you Push it into your face just like that and try to make it really small so nobody see. 
um, the silk, okay? Alright, so just like that, all the way in, okay? And be careful not to open up your hands, be careful. keep it in a natural position. Because when you keep it into in a natural position, it looks like there's absolutely nothing, okay? So, um, you start by taking, showing your hands empty, okay? And you take the um, yellow silk and you place it into your face, you give it a magic pass, the same routine, okay? And then after that, a red silk will appear. Okay? Do it really slowly, you must be patient. Okay? Don't do it too fast because if you do it too fast, this will happen. And people will know that you have two silks. So do it really, really slowly, a little bit at a time, you know, must be patient with it. All the way in, just like that. Okay? And you can tell people I've changed a yellow silk into a red silk. And remember to keep your hand in a natural position because when you do that, people think there's absolutely nothing. And you can see there's nothing over here and there's nothing over here. And now that you have learned a trick, go home, practice, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. And you know, if you want to check out my works, you know, the link is just down below. See you in my next show.